Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome back to Super Mario and the Ancient Stars. Oh, nice! That teleports me straight back to the Star Sanctuary. Hold on, what's my volume at? Oh, wrong button. Okay. So, so, I was told by the person who made this about how to get to places that I had failed to reach before. And also, I have decided to go to things in the recommended order in the hopes of having enough lives to handle later worlds. So, so, yeah, suppose I go down here, yeah, and then I wind up here. Okay, that makes sense. Book number five, the outcome. It was clear that they, they couldn't just leave the sanctuary unguarded. They have created other stars, which much less power. They were supposed to guard the place forever, so they did. When the first kingdoms were created, they have chosen the one creature to protect the place as well, and for generations it was a sacred place where no one could enter. Oh, so they do have the power to create as well as to destroy. Present times. Present date? Present time! <laughs> they watched the world change. Love and friendship being spread across the globe. Maybe they should open the gates and finally release their good vibes on the beings living here? The stated that their first step to getting communicative with the natives is to create holidays. They let the... What number is that? 1, 2, 3... 520,943rd guard, Rosalina, to have something they call fun, finally. We all know what happened next. The question is, what does Crypto want to do with all this power? You know, that is a good question. I don't care what Crypto wants to do with all this power. I'm taking it now. So, I forgot to actually check what level they recommend doing first, but... So I'm just going to go to the jungle. The Wooden Path. Well, that sounds interesting. Oh, hey, D. Hey, Mario, look out for those weeds. You can't hurt them. Oh, just you watch. Hey, B, you're ugly. Oh. Nice sign there telling me that that's a bottomless abyss. Oh, hey, what's that? Crypto. Um. What? What is this? Uh, okay. I I I'm not sure that this is what is supposed to be happening here, but... That is what is happening there. Oh, my bad. I messed up my jump. Alright, so. Oh my. I have a visitor. I had a visitor once. Oh my, that is a scary extra life to chase after. Oh, I didn't jump soon enough. That extra life is now no longer worth the effort it takes to get to it. Alright, so... I am so weirded out by this entity. I mean, is that what it's supposed to be doing? Just flashing the face of a... Crypto? I don't know. But whatever. I shall crush Crypto. Okay, now I could get that extra life by sacrificing a hit. But... I'd rather not. Oh. What? Darn it. Again, I messed up. But whatever. Whatever. I'll just keep pushing forward. Through my mistakes. Alright, so then. Ow. Uh, sorry about that. Needed to deal with something else. Things pop up and... 
that need dealing with sometimes. Anywho. Anywho. Time to, uh... Continue my bizarre ascent. One day I'll make it through this properly. One day. One day. Oh, I have another visitor. Okay, so. What? How do I get up? Wait. There is a reason that that I'm receiving so many Koopas here, isn't there? Yes. Yes, there is. Okay. Okay, so. Now, turtle friends. Hello, turtles. I cannot reach you. Okay, I'm having trouble telling which of these uh, objects are background objects and which are not. And that is not necessarily a good thing. And that is not at all a good thing. Make the background objects look more different from the foreground objects. Alright, I'm out of power-ups. Today is a chaotic day. Oh wow, wasn't expecting that. Better. Where's the midpoint? Well, there's the exit. Where's the midpoint? Okay. Okay. Okay, now I'm terrified because this is supposed to be a post-midpoint area. Whoa! And yet I do not have a midpoint to work with. So, I'm going to, uh... I'm going to cower in fear as I try and make these jumps. Alright. Alright. Oh, that, that vine isn't real. Wait. Okay. I managed to pull back my jump in time. Okay. Okay. I was trying to climb up this vine, and it just wasn't working, and then I fell off because I wasn't comprehending that uh, climbing up the vine wasn't working. Even though it should have, ow, been obvious from the fact that it wasn't working, that it wasn't working. Alright. These vines do work, though, right? Yeah, good. Okay, power up again. For how often I get hit, the, I feel like this game has a good distribution of power moves. Okay. Okay. And honestly, those are some... The midpoint exists now! <sighs> okay, that was a weird glitch. And hold on a moment, something has come up again. Chainsaw Chase. It has a secret exit, I assume. Oh no! Ah! Oh wow, that chainsaw is lava.
Well, that makes sense because you, you don't. Darn it, why didn't you jump, Mario? I tried to jump and Mario didn't jump. How embarrassing. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Okay. But anyway, as I was saying, you want that to be lava and not spikes so that you don't have a ton of enemies sticking around longer than they should. Ugh. I keep messing up. I blame this one shy, shy folk here. Come on. Okay. Yeesh. Wow, that was a close one. Eh. Oh good, there's an extra life, but I'm too terrified of the level to go get it. Alright. Oh, what's this do? I have no idea what that did. No! Why didn't you jump, Mario? <sighs> this level makes me all panicky. And that makes me perform worse. I mean, the level isn't that hard, I'm just performing it badly. This, this episode is... Darn it! Where was your forward momentum, Mario? This episode is a lot more difficult than I was expecting it to be. That's not a bad thing. It's just... I wasn't ready for this. Alright, so... Darn it. Hold on, something else needs my attention. So, erg, I messed up my jump. I feel like this level could really do with giving me a uh, um, power up, just so I can feel more confident diving into where there are shy folk. Alright. Arg. Alright, alright. Hopefully I can get out of here. Darn it! I feel like maybe the level is going a little bit too fast. That being said, I do like that it's not swarming me with darn it, shy folk. Like, this level knows exactly where to put single enemies to provide challenge. No, why didn't you jump, Mario? Huh. 
so... A lot of these vines are traps. Alright, so... So, okay. Okay, I made it up to the top-ish. Alright. Tag this. Ha! Ah, take that, shy entity. Err. See, the thing about this level is that it, uh... Is that you want to move fast in order to get through things, but the shy folk make you want to slow down and let them walk safely by. Alright, so that was a secret exit. What's this do? Jungle Toad's house. Hello, Jungle Toad. What is up? Hello there, Traveler. I don't have many visitors here. It's quite an unusual view of somebody but myself. Ha! Huh, I've been saving this prize for a guest. It looks like you are the winner. Okay. What prize? Oh, nice! Thank you. Alright. Now, back to the chainsaw chase. Where shy folk are immune to fire. That's always puzzled me. But, I mean, it's how it is in the base engine. It just puzzles me. That shy folk are immune to fire. Alright, take that. Yeah, no, I'm not going for that extra life. I am too scared to. Alright, so. Oh, come on. Make that jump. And now I don't have to worry about that. Woo! Alright. Alright, and now I make my way up to the standard exit. <sighs> humid islands. Hmm, I don't like humidity. That was actually a really cool level once I got into the groove of it, it just I kept messing up early. Welcome to the Humid Islands. This area is a natural habitat for a lot of unusual creatures. You can meet here squids, wafts, fish, and even wigglers. You may see warnings ahead. Stay away of those areas. Hmm. I like the... I like the plant life on the surface of the water here. Hold on. Something needs my attention. Alright, so, hop, mm. clever use, once again I encounter this, I have no idea what is up with that, and another one grows, I, I don't know what is up with that, I'm just so confused. Take extra care. Those wigglers are not so easy to defeat. When you hit them, they will chase you. Oh, nice. So you so you set it up so that destroying a wiggler replaces it with a red one. Nice. So not doing that in that earlier level with the trees was deliberate. Hello, toad. Hello there, traveler. It looks like there is water in this lake. I could... Or no water in this lake. I could fill it, but it'll cost you a favor. There are some nasty wigglers in my garden. Could you please remove them? Thanks. I could remove them. Yes. Hello, Wiggler. You have been removed. Hmm. Clever use of bees to force me to 
approach the Wiggler just so. Yes, but I have defeated the Wiggler. Hello, you. Thank you. Now I'll release the water into the lake. Yay. Lake water. Hello, lake. You now have water in you. Isn't that nice? Hello, Wiggler. Alright, so. Midpoint. Huh. What's going on here? Hello, Toad. I am stealing your stuff. Hello there! It seems that pail is trouble for you, eh? No problem, I'll simply move it. What? No way! The mechanism is blocked. You have to go down there and fix it. Okay, so I guess I'll go down there and fix it. What do I do down here? Um... Toad? Toad, what's going on? Oh, nice humidity clouds. Let's see, I can't go in here. Toad, where do I have to go to fix things? Did something break? Is something broken? I don't know. Let's see, I can't get up here, so that means that whatever I'm doing, it has to be in this region. I cannot enter this door. There's no pipe here. Um... Hmm. Okay, I made it. Could I be looking for something over here? Like, is this pipe what I'm looking No? You! Do you have things? You don't even talk anymore. Um... Yeah, I'm not sure what to do from here. I and mean, I have to... Wait, wait, I am dumb. There's a pipe right here. Why am I dumb? I am sorry to everyone who is watching this and banging your head against the desks. Attention, do not touch these grinds. Okay. I will not touch these gears. They will probably grind me up. Okay, I am sorry to my viewers, I was being dumb. Oh nice, a mushroom as a reward for making it down here. Um, hmm. Well, off I go. Hey Toad! Wow, you actually did it! The pail is not trouble anymore. Okay, so that spike is not a, gonna be a problem anymore. Wow, I was. I'm so sorry, everyone who was watching this, who saw what I was doing wrong and couldn't do anything about it. Alright, alright, whoop. I was gonna try and jump over that, then I realized I didn't have the momentum. Hmm, I wonder. Oh, I was hoping to use that to as a way to farm for lives when I realized I was going to keep spawning, but it didn't keep spawning. Hey you, so you want to go through that lake? Trust me friend, you don't. There is a gigantic octopus living in that water. If you want to cross these waters, you have to deal with it first. Also, I'll lower that wall and even give you something. Good luck out there. Something else needs my attention. Alright, oh, thank you for the fireball. Alright, spike is lowered. Oh, there's a squid boss. Hello, squid boss. Hello, squid boss. Huh, how do I deal with you? Do I just run away? 
Oh! Oh, I see. Alright. So... Get... Get me back. Alright. So... Ah, my bad. I'm just trying to s score multi-hits with my, with each toss. Okay, okay, I have dealt with the giant squid monster. Clever boss. Oh. Laundry alarm. That was a pretty cool boss. Alright. Night of the Jungle? Hmm. These levels feel like they've been pretty long, and, uh, things have been really chaotic here. I'm gonna call it here for the day. Join me tomorrow when I visit the jungle at night, I guess. Why does it sound so familiar?